Hello YouTubers! Today I can come closer and then see what is my new toy. I'm gonna move it around so you don't have to. It's designed in France so it is supposedly supposedly uh, be a uh, is sexy and uh, very easy to use. So let's see, it's a Schneider electronic. That's how it looks. USB adapter, cable. It's the solar light, nothing special about it. I was just reading and main reason why I did buy it is this thing here. It's a nice, nice, nice. And you can have a data here. It's a solar cell. Industrial. Good protected. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It says uh, 500 milliamps. And it comes with a long cable. They say, I think, five meters or something. And yeah, it's really long. It's really, really, really long. So if you have to place your solar cell and uh, on solar, on the sun somewhere, you can go, see, you can go all the way here and put your solar light, which is really nice. Nice. So you just easy plug it here and it's supposed to work. Right? Put it on the sun. And it should work. Yeah, it's blinking here. It's blinking here. If you can see, it should blink green. Pink, pink, pink. Maybe you don't see. Very good. Why did I buy it? Just because it's one click, another click, and another click, and it's off. When you first time click it, you watch here. Well, actually, maybe not. When you first time click it, it should. Oh, because it's charging now. Anyway, good thing about this, you can hook it up. It's perfect for the for trouble, right? For mobile thing. It's charging. It's nice. It is uh, floating and it says here in the papers, I think on the box also says, but in the paper says that it should be uh, submersible. It's a 1.2 watt. Let's see, light output, low, medium, high. And it has, mm, I think it's submersible. In the water. Wait a minute, I saw it somewhere. Mm -hmm. For an hour. Okay, here. See? Water resistant up to 0.5 meters deep depth for one hour. I love it. I'm crazy about this stuff. See? I want you to see, see it light, it's charging. It's blinking green light, so it means it's charging. The good thing about this is, with this adapter, I'm gonna try it on my phone. With this charger, it has a USB, mini USB, mini USB, micro USB, I think it's Nokia and a normal plug and this thing so you can plug it here and you can plug it here and then you can charge your phone all this way so unplug it here see it's charging my phone can even charge my phone while giving the light of course so it is a uh, it's really good it's charging my phone and it's 
good. It's nice, funny French design, but this is this was like a 50 bucks Canadian. I bought it in an EE coal company here for electrical supply. I just I just like the design. I like the robustness and protection. And of course, long cable, long, long, long cable. It has the battery inside. Hmm. What does it say? The battery type is. Mm -hmm. I don't have that kind of battery. And just remember, it's a different. It's not lithium ion. It's a different type of the battery. Something lithium ferrite or ferrite, whatever the name is. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Charging the uh, 9 volts, 1 amp, and USB 5 volts. Let me see this thing here. What is it now? Okay. Of course, when I look for something, it's never there. Battery type. I don't find the battery. It's driving me crazy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, here, there we go. 3.2 mil, 3 amp hour lithium ferrophosphate. Lithium ferrophosphate, that's a new type of battery. And it says 3 amp hour, that's good. So basically, it's gonna give you 3 hours, 1 hour, 1 amp, 3 hours long, 3.2 volts. <laughs> I just can't help it. I'm, I'm crazy about solar stuff. And this is really, really nice, nice solar panel. You get phone charger, and then you have emergency light. Works very good, protected, and good. Thanks for watching. I hope I wasn't too annoying. Bye bye. <laughs> Till next time.